Howdy folks, your DOS here, back with some more Final Fantasy XI. Today's video is just going to be a sh sh blah, blah, short, <laughs> get my words out, short update for Bear DOS's recent activity. I did want to do and had said the last time we were going to get into the nitty gritty of my thief gear, current and planned, but Life's not been up for letting me get that done. So I have a different sort of plan for how we're going to get that done, which I'll get to later. But for now, what have we been up to? Well, as you can see, we are glowing. Stupidly, I did not get a recording of me finishing it, but the man dev is now finished. Oh yes. Uh, I say stupidly, it's probably just more excitedly. I was really, really, really eager to get it finished. Um, so yeah, we've got that done on Beardos. We also have two pieces of Relic Plus 2 in the shape of our Plunderer's Bonnet and our Plunderer's Vest. What you're seeing just now is my current... In fact, is my neck... I think that might be the Aspirant, actually. I think, I think, I think. That was it. There was. Yeah, I think that is my current TP set. I think. Could be wrong. And this may actually be one of my new items. The ginseng. Might be. I can't quite remember. Don't have it to hand at the moment. Um, this isn't actually the video I had planned for tonight. But. Yeah, universe, life, all those things combining to make this be what has to be recorded. So yeah, this is currently what we are rocking. Our Tutatis' cape is dual wield because I'm very rarely based capped. Well, uh, dual capped, sorry. So yeah, that works out better in all of the uh, spreadsheets, apart from when I am dual wield capped. So yeah, that is currently, that look is what I currently have when I'm DPing, but that's not what we see because screw that headpiece. What I actually rock around in is, I want to rock around, this, yeah, Herculean hands, Blunderer's Colots, and the Terminal Helm, which was something again just got recently. Be right at the bottom. Yeah, Terminal Helm. Uh, it comes from the Ultima and Omega high tier mission battlefield. Uh, been doing a lot of the high tier mission battlefields. So Beardos has the Terminal Helm. Uh, mainly for, at the moment at least, style lock purposes. Aim is that our group all has that and the body just so we can look a bit menacing just for shiz and giggles. Uh, we also got the Jinsen from Tenzin's fight as well as his kick ass bow for our Sam. Uh, we got the Toga Kushi Shurikens from Titan when we did a difficult run of that, so that was really cool. Uh, our ninja shurikens are pretty much sorted now. Uh, did we get anything else for them? It would be a new... Ah, ba 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 Got a decent... Um, in fact, I'll get to that point later when I start talking about Jimmy updates, although Jimmy updates I'll get into in a different video actually. Um, nothing new here. Got our first 100 rusty die cards. We're currently trying to sell a Beastman's Medal because it works out better off to sell it than at the current price at least on Bismarck and to keep a hold of it. Or to buy Beastman's Medals to make up a, a shard. Uh, anything else? Uh, oh, we made a Shiji as well, which 
I am currently working on the other plutons probably it's going to be that we use to make that nice and shiny. I've been looking at my ninja sets recently. Um, I did get, uh, in fact that's something else I got, the Aizushin Togo, which is a damn nice katana from Esharuan. I've yet to augment that, but it will be very shiny alongside the Shuji. And then it's just a case of sorting out the rest of my gear. We're in a, a, a middling, uh, not even a middling, uh, a low level, not an entry level, but a low level, as far as our ninja's concerned. Uh, through the current Naizul campaign, I got that Nibiru shield, which looks kind of cool at least. And until we get our bow chain finished, it'll do for physical damage fights, I suppose, rather than the Aegis. Uh, anything else in there? I want to say no. And that is what I am saying. So yeah, that is how it currently sits. I've been doing a hell of a lot of stuff. Actually a lot more than... And I have been recently on Beardos actually, to the point where I do have a lot of hours of footage recorded and even more I didn't record. Um, so once once we eventually do get moved, the streaming possibility is, is very very strong, which is good. Um, as you can see, I also bought some Beastmasters, and that annoys me. You've got the normal job abbreviation for Beast for the torso shards, but the foot shards is PSM. Huh? Was it was it an intern that named them? But yeah, I got them cheap, so um, I'm actually giving the foot shard to Aid Adria from my link shell um, because I got it cheap as chips, and he has actually been in a dynamics as a beastmaster and beastmasters lower down in my tiers of what I want to actually work on getting sorted. I do want to get this sorted because it's one of Bear Dossie's focuses, as we've discussed previously. But it's back burner-ish at the moment. Um, so I'll now go on to what I was talking about earlier on. My thought on how I'm going to go about the breakdown videos of current and future aims for jobs. The waterfall in the background is lovely. Marjami Ravine that we're in, by the way, in case you didn't realise. Um, I realised that we've been to Zita and Round Gardens, so I figured I'd go somewhere else in my top 10 areas. And Marjami just sort of jumped at me. So, um, yeah, what I plan to do is either a few, since we've got six focuses, it could be either six or three videos in which I tackle one or two jobs and talk about current sets for them and future sets, future goals. Where you guys can chime in with anything you would suggest instead. Obviously I go through the spreadsheets that I use, the DPS spreadsheets, obviously a lot of numbers, not necessarily going to be the true case of them are for all instances, but certainly keeps me sort of an idea. I like seeing a number when that is better than that, therefore it's better. Um, that's also why it's taken a bit longer for me to get through these. Um, so yeah, once I have all of the spreadsheets sorted, um, it just takes a bit of time to get them done. Um, I'll be able to get these videos sorted and get them fired up. The plan is so that a week like the past week effectively doesn't happen where I actually better gear pretty quickly. 
I'm actually going to have a week of releases for them. Um, so instead of the usuals, it will just be a week of 11 with the usual stuff that I have going up on a daily basis apart from the 11 usuals so say or I'm describing this terribly <laughs> um, at the moment it is Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday for 11 so Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday would not be 11 for that week every day of that week would be 11 so Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday would be something completely different on that week with the other days made up of the usual videos so yeah hopefully that will be soon I don't want to get too far past it's too far away from now but the universe has its ways I'm actually amazed I've managed 11 minutes now without my daughter crying out because it's she's been having a really bad night um, so yeah that this is currently where Bear Doss is um, in the past maybe a couple of weeks we spent 12 mil um, finishing <laughs> finishing the man down spent maybe 40 or 50 mil yeah probably about 40 um, including taking a loan from the bank of my wife's characters <laughs> But yeah, um, well done, and it's the oh, Otamanda is shiny. It is very, very shiny. I like it. Yes, there are better things out there, but I really like that, and I really want you to finish them. Anyway, I think that's that's about all I had to say. Um, I still have other stuff I want to get from some of the high tier mission battlefields that we're doing at the moment. We're spamming them quite a bit. Uh, Tenzin we have absolutely obliterated on very difficult um, so I'm hoping to get that footage out I'm not sure how I'll do that it might just be a one run of that one run of um, Ultima and Omega with a run of each of the Esha Ruan enemies we've been doing as well don't know it, it really just depends um, I'd like to not have the footage all go to waste <laughs> um, so let me know if you guys want to see that or how you guys want to see it uh, I can certainly chuck it all up there's there's no mic because I'm obviously talking with the guys while I'm doing this and one-sided conversations just really sound weird um, so yeah, if you could let me know in the comments below what you think about that. And yeah, just carry on letting me know what you guys want to see. Um, I had been planning, um, talking about Jimmy here, um, for Jimmy's Corsair to be the next job that we went to. But I am happy to change it. The Blue Mage. Um, plan is different in the sense that it's going to just be a sort of it's just going to be an update video a week I think on what what spells we learned um, just showing you each spell as they're learned probably and telling you where we got level wise because it's going to be tedious and yeah I think that's probably just the best way to do it. Um, but yeah, as always, thank you for your continued support. Last month was fantastic for the channel. Apparently people like trust videos. Who knew? Um, so if you're new to the channel, thank you for joining. You've been here from the get-go. Thank you, as always, for your continued support. I've been Beardos, he's been Beardos. This has been Final Fantasy XI and an update for Beardos. A whole lot of bear dust right there. You guys take it easy. 
have a good day, night, evening, morning, whatever, whatever the time happens to be. Adios.